Welcome back to my channel. Turn back to King of the Hills, Funniest Moments number two. So before I get into this, I just want to say please hit subscribe button, hit thumbs up, it really helps support the channel. Also, check out my Rumble channel down below in the description because on my Rumble channel, I'm posting free full length TV show and movie reactions. But yeah, let's get into this. That's my purse! I don't know you! Oh! <laughs> no hats in the lunchroom, Dooley. Take it off. I'll die in these horns. Well, what an interesting Yo, what's with the you know quarter? What? Tell me it's all the way through. Uh, looks like it is, y'all. Oh, well, enjoy. I'm sitting in a chair. I never know quite what to do with my head. So this, this, this is wonderful. Thank you. Mm. Bobby, this is Topsy. Topsy babysat your daddy when he was a boy. And he's going to babysit your uncle, too. I need the money. Mm -hmm. You're the au pair they were talking about? Come here, son. Go ahead and get a good look at you. Mm. Go on, Bobby. Let Topsy <laughs> get a look at you. Okay. Can you see me from there? <laughs> I'm not gonna bite you. He can't. Had all his teeth yanked out of his head because oh, he so was he'll green. gum you to death. Get a little closer. My eyes ain't as good as they used to be. Topsy's legally blind. <laughs> That's Do nasty. It again, Topsy. Well, yeah, dude. I mean, Dad. Uh, give me a second. I. I think I just got a a bottle cap in my eye. A bottle cap. Oh Dios por tu gracia. Por Dios Cristo. Señor, ten piedad. Por la madre. Which way is the Houston? He didn't know what to do. He stood up me while they were just leaning forward. Oh, that's great. On the pews or whatever. Pews. Por Dios Cristo. Señor, ten piedad. <laughs> Por la madre. Get down. Boom. Oh, nice. Which Good night. way is the Houston <laughs> Hospital? I'm not sure. Oh. Pull over and ask for directions. I can't do that. I shouldn't even be driving this car. Oh. I know where the Arlen Hospital is. It's two hours away. Can two you Two hours? Again? Oh. Go around! Please, go around! I can't see where I'm going. I'll put it on cruise control and stand on the seat. That's what Cotton does when we pass an accident. I can't! <laughs> the red light keeps telling me to brake. Oh, I think you need to release the parking brake. Oh, fart. <gasps> What the hell? Dale? <gasps> yeah, hot. You need a shot, Shug. I knew it. He's gonna jump out the window. Crazy ass guy. Okay, droop your eyelids. Now unflare that nostril. That's it. Wait, what? Perfect. Dad, look at my poker face. Mom, Dad, Jane was waiting for me after school. Did you remember to tell him that inside every bully there's a coward? Maybe he's right. I can't do this. Sure you can, Bobby. Just remember, to catch a fish, you have to think like a fish. Hmm. I'm wet, and I don't even know it. Oh. Uh. No. Where would you be feeding? Probably in that algae-covered area over there. That algae does look pretty good. Damn, your parking sucks. <laughs> Where's my wife? Uh, hello? Ah, do something, Topsy! Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> do something else! I guess we'll just camp somewhere else next year. Well, well that's funny. maybe it's like what you said. If you want to catch a fish, you have to think like a fish. We just have to think like hippies. That is impossible. Come on, Dad. Just try. Okay. Think I'm like a hippie. hippie. I'm naked because I smoked all no. those. Uh, yep. Yep. Mm-hmm. Yep. Mm. If I never went back to work, I don't think anyone would notice. Sure they would, Bill. When there's suddenly enough food to go around. 
All right. Now, as you all know, Mother's Day is coming up, and I thought it might be fun to talk about some of the famous moms throughout history. What's wrong with you, Bobby? Uh, no. What I was going to going to say. Yes, what I was going, going to, to say, say. Going to say. We heard the preview. Now get to the feature. Bobby. God damn, Bobby. What do you want? Only drugged out people are like that shit. I can't sit still. Maybe he's got ADD. I don't know. Or ADHD. Sorry. Sorry again about the border around the whole video. I don't know who did this. It's whoever posted this video. We're just going to keep going. Bobby. 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 I'm gonna let you off with just a warning. If you promise to drive safely. Oh, I promise. And not just because safe driving is cool, but because it's the right thing to do. Exactly. Sit down. All right, here's where we're at. I made a big, big mistake. We've got no insurance. Okay. Bobby, don't you realize how important this is? All our policies have lapsed. Our house, so? everything in it, our vehicles, nothing is protected. The safety net's gone. Gone. I hear the words you're saying, and I believe you believe it's important. Uh, hello, Peggy. Hello, Hike. Hello, Mom! Oh, we the should hell? call her parents in case they're worried. Lalame su familia Lupe. Mi familia no tiene teléfono. Oh. oh, she refuses to call home because her family hates her. No. What's the hate? Dumbass. Yo soy un madre y yo soy certeno y su madre amore yo mucho mucho. No tengo la menor idea de lo que me están diciendo, <laughs> pero más vale que no sea nada malo de mi mamá. I was afraid of this. Now she wishes that I was her mother. If your father or Herr Geiger find out about this, it's over. We will hide her until morning, and when your father goes to work, I will smuggle her back into Mexico. Now give her some space. She does not like you. Take this to Lupe. Oh my God, Bobby, did you rat me out? Did yeah. you? How yeah. How much did they give you? A couple hundred dollars. No, I'm playing. Can't believe you asked your own son that. That's the worst. Well, what are you doing, girl? You leave a bone in there? A ball? No, a foreigner. Ah, a bone. Ah, uh, Peggy, oh. there's a little Mexican girl in the utility huh. closet. Must be afraid of Bobby's. So, Bobby, what you gonna do with your life? I'm gonna be a prop comic. I'm working on this like big one stick a green bean up my nose. Well, now that sounds promising. Hank, Bobby and me have decided he's gonna stick vegetables up his nose. He's not gonna take over the family gas station. Dad, I don't work at a gas station. <laughs> and right. accessories. Don't sass me, boy. You ain't too big for me to give you a licking. <laughs> oh, Dad, you old skunk. Come on, girl. God damn. Hey, would you two mind watching him until things settle down with Cotton? Of course, Aunt Peggy. This will be a great way for Lucky and me to practice being parents. I will play the mother. Perfect. With that guy. What happened? He's stepping in an x-ray machine? He's on something. Hey, Bobby, you're going to come stay with us for a while. Why? Um, uh... I'll handle this. Bobby, there's a crazy man killing all the children in your neighborhood. So until they catch him, you'd be in grave danger here. I'm scared to kid the but shits, this man. Crash went away Jeez. And I could wear pants again. Yep. Yep. Dale, Hank's going to become a tugboat captain. Yep. Mm hmm. Jaga, <coughs> ik snack, bungo. <coughs> mm hmm. No one listens to me. Do you guys think horses remember horses things? Do James? I know exactly who that voice is. No one listens to me. That voice is off the TV show I've been reacting to on my Rumble channel called News Radio. And Bill is the owner. Well, the voice actor Bill is the owner of uh, the radio station of a TV show I watch. Anyways, it's a good show. You should check it out on my Rumble channel down below in the description. 
Do you guys think horses <coughs> remember things from when they were little? Sir, you are in an exit row. Will you be able to assist other passengers in case of an emergency? Absolutely. Is your son under 13? He has to be 13 or older to sit in an emergency row. He is 13. Ah. To be honest, he's a great kid, but in an emergency, uh, I don't know. Dad! I'm sorry, Bobby. What can yeah. I say? He's right. We're too hot on him. He's gonna hate us forever and rebel. We tried being tough and we tried being soft, but we haven't tried doing both at the same time. What? Bobby Hale, come here this instant! Yeah? Stand up straight. Surprise, your very own ladder. What the fuck? Tuck in your shirt. What are you gonna give Dad, you're it. Go to your room. I'll sneak you some pudding. Floss! Marco! I can't take it anymore! Right? You guys are nuts. Uh, we are going to be such good parents. Nah. Yep. Is that their favorite thing? Yep. Yep. Wait. Hank smoking? Mm. Mm. And in about a half hour, you should find yourself real interested in stuff that would normally bore the pants off you. How's that? Round and round and round it goes. When he eats it, nobody knows. <laughs> Mercy! Mister, what did you eat? Okay. Don't look him in the eye, it makes him start howling. Okay. So, thought you could just waltz in here and kill me, did you? Well, so did he. Damn it. Wanna listen to music, Ging Ging? All right. Wanna watch me dance, Ging Ging? All right. Oh, hell no, man. Don't you dare start getting weird. Hear that, boy? I'm empty. Time to fill my gullet. Don't you wish I don't know why people are always Wait, saying what the how fuck? hard it is to be gay. It's wonderful, really. Motherfucker, what? Where's my new dependent? I'm supposed to look at it. Where did I put... Oh, there it is. Uncle, I present you to your father. Look at him. His shins are perfect. Hank's brother. Look at you. You're a handsome little soldier. You want to kill a nazi? A nazi nazi squazy? <laughs> Anyways. <clears throat> That's King of the Hill. Funniest moments number two. If y'all like that, please have subscribe button. Hit thumbs up. Why not leave a comment? Like I said, check my Rumble channel, channel out down below in the description. And follow that if you can. It really helps. Other than that, take care for now.